All right. Shalom, shalom. First and foremost, before I get started, as always, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh Bashim Al Shai, Waharacha Kodash, with Yahweh. That's the name of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shai. That's whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. That's his true name. And the Racha Kodash, that is the Holy Spirit. And I also want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well in the scriptures. And salutations to all the brothers out there who are pushing the word in all truth and in all sincerity. And I want to do a, another lesson that's based on why the two-thirds should be destroyed. All right. And basically, what you see on screen here is the aftermath of a shooting in a Chicago suburb, all right, called Willowbrook. And, you know, just to give uh, those who are listening an um, understanding of this uh, area, it's basically an, an uppity suburb, okay? And, you know, you have a lot of Edomites out there, a lot of Elam, all right, a couple Moabites. You know, Ishmael's out there too. And, um, you know, like I said, you know, it's actually a nice area. But there's um, a pocket of Willowbrook that's um, Section 8. And pretty much what happened um, in the uh, like late 90s, roughly mid to late 90s, and uh, definitely late, uh, throughout, uh, you know, the 2000s, what happened in Chicago was they uh, tore down a lot of projects okay which we know who lives in the projects all right it's all jake and um what happened was they dispersed those jakes that lived in the uh the projects throughout the suburbs okay and like i said out there in willowbrook there's a little pocket where it's you know a bunch of section eight you know complexes and it's just a bunch of low life jakes and i've uh bypassed there many of times and um you know you, you go into the parking lot of uh of the uh, complex and you would think you were in the projects no no lie you know you got people you know smoking blunts hitting the, you know uh the, the the remy okay blasting their music all right it, it's it's ridiculous to be honest all right, but um, right nearby, you know, that Section 8, uh, you know, you know, area, there's this mini mall or the, this mall strip, that, as you see on screen. And basically what they uh, were doing over there was celebrating uh, that Juneteenth, you know, BS. OK, you know, uh, at night, it was a uh, Saturday night and uh, somebody aired out the spot. OK, somebody aired it out. And uh, I believe it was about like 23 people uh, were shot and uh, one ended up dying. Okay. And um, I ended up bypassing this area and it, it was terrible. Okay. It was terrible. You know, you had gl uh, uh, window glass everywhere. Bullets literally everywhere. Okay. It, 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 it was bad, man. Okay. But this is why... The two thirds, uh, you know, got to get destroyed. Hey, they are, as the scriptures call them, they are brute beasts made to be destroyed. This is beast activity, man. Okay. And that, and that, like, uh, Elder Crab always brings us out here in Chicago. He always makes that statement of, uh, I understand why the heathens hate Jake, you know, and I understand it too. Cause this is, uh, th this, this is a vexation. Okay. This is the vex, uh, vexation. Every time you get around Jake's, this is what uh, occurs. Okay? You know? And this is why, you know, the majority of our people have to be destroyed. All right? But let's get a scripture. All right? Let's get this in uh, Hosea 4 and 1. It reads here, Hear the word of the Lord Yahweh, ye children of Israel. For the Lord Yahweh hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land because there is no truth nor mercy nor knowledge of the most high in the land so the lord has a controversy with our people and as we just read it's because there's no truth all right meaning that there's a there's no uh, uh knowledge of the scriptures 
okay, in the community. It says, no mercy. And our people, they're quick to judge one another. Okay? That, that, that's, a, that's a known fact. Hey, the, the, all, all the tribes, they're quick to kill one another. They're, they're, they're quick to stomp somebody out. Over, you know, the pettiest things. Okay? Over the pettiest things. And it says what? No knowledge of the Most High in the land. Okay? Let's keep reading. It says what? By swearing and lying and killing and stealing and committing adultery, they break out and blood touches blood. And that's what's in our community. All right? There's nothing but lying, murdering, stealing, adultery. Okay? And this is why things like this occur. You know, pride, envy, all these things, okay? Well, when you when you throw that in the uh, the pot, so to speak, and you stir it all up, this is the result of it. People, people getting, you know, shot, okay, injured, some, you know, uh, uh, you know, die, pass away, okay. This is the result of all these things. And you see, our people, they love it. They love when this occurs. You know, they'll sit there and cry, all right, and and complain. But deep down inside, they love this. They love the drama. Now they got something to talk about, okay? <laughs> you know, they, 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 they can, you know, do a, 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 a Instagram, you know, post on it, you know, or a video, okay? They can vlog about it, you see? Our people are completely nuts, man. That's why the Lord's got to destroy them. They're just gone. Okay? And if our people really hated this behavior, what would they do? They would return unto Yahweh Shemal Shai, change their ways, and cry out for, um, for help. For, for, uh, for uh, you know, uh, they would cry out to, you know, for, 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 uh, to, to be saved. They would sigh and cry for all the abominations that are done thereof or therein as the scripture say in the book of ezekiel 9 and 4 that's what they would be doing but if you're not doing these things you love this type of living which is really not a way of living it's a death style okay you see let me keep uh reading it says here uh this is a hosea 4 and 3 therefore shall the land mourn and everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish with the beasts of the field with the fowls of heaven Yea, the fishes of the sea also shall be taken away. You see? The land is going to mourn. And everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish. Perfect example. Boom. Like I said, this is all by that uh, by, by Jake pocket. Okay, that section, uh, section 8 pocket. As you don't see this stuff happening, all right, or, you know, not, uh, not too far from, um, from, this, uh, uh, from this area. Like I said, you got uh, nothing but Edomites, okay, and Elamites over there, and some, you know, Ishmaelites. Everything's fine in their pocket. You don't see them shooting up, you know, uh, the neighborhood. You know what I mean? You, you, you know, you don't see them uh, stealing from each other like that. Like I said, this stuff always happens in Jake pockets, man. And that's ultimately because, really, they've learned the way of the wicked, you know, they've learned the way of the wicked and, and, and this is the result of it. All right, but that's a whole nother lesson within itself. But let's keep reading. Back in Hosea chapter 4 verse 4 it says here, Yet let no man strive nor reprove another, for thy people are as they that strive with the priest. And that's what they do. They fight with us. The ones that are given this, um, this, uh, uh, this uh, 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 you know, this message, this holy message, okay, this good news. They fight with us. And that's because we reprove them. We tell them what they're doing is wrong. And that there's a punishment for them. If they don't repent. And see our people don't want to hear that. They want to continue to do these. Uh, activities. Alright. Because it, you know, it pleases the flesh. Because ultimately that's what these things do. Okay. That's what sin does. It, it, it pleases 
all right? The flesh, you know? That's why our people don't want to stop because when you follow Yahweh Bashimi Al Shai, now you have what? A standard and you have an order to, you know, uh, uh, follow and abide by. And see, our people don't like that. You see? Let's keep reading. Hosea 4 and 5 now. Therefore shall thou fall in the day, and the prophet also shall fall with thee in the night. I will destroy thy mother. My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of the Most High, I will also forget thy children. So our people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Okay? And when you have no knowledge, now your behavior is that of a brute beast. Hey, and those brute beasts are made to be destroyed. These are, are the ones that were born in vain. They're fuel to the fire. Okay? That's their whole purpose in life. As of right now. You know? The two-thirds are meant to get eliminated. They're not... They're, they're, they're uh, basically... They're the example of what not to be. You know? Okay? Let me keep reading. Let me finish this off. Hosea 4 and 7. As they were increased, so they sinned against me. Therefore, why change their glory into shame? And, and, and that's what's happened. Okay? We, we were supposed to be, you know, those glorious people. Okay? We were supposed to be uh, uh, the ones everyone, you know, looked in, you know, uh, you know, basically looked up to. That's not happening anymore. We're a shameful people. We're a shameful people. This is ridiculous. Look at this. You know? Then I was hearing Edomites talk about this, who live, you know, in the nearby suburbs. They were, you know, mentioning all this. And you could tell, you know, uh, they, they, you know, just, you know, um, their, um, you know, how they were talking about it. They were disgusted. And like I told, uh, like I mentioned earlier, this area before, you know, you know, let's just say the 2000s, right? This was a, a, a top tier a uh, 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 suburb and now it, it's going downhill because more and more Jake are entering into it and they're bring, uh, bringing that black culture with them that death culture you know and people hate it because it's, it's not productive it's all, all it is is destructive and these Edomites you know they're uh, they're pissed about it because they they, 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 they they don't want to have to worry about their kids okay you know, getting shot at while they're riding their bike. You know what I'm saying? They don't want their... Oh, but my, oh I'll say this too. A couple of um, neighboring uh, homes, all right, they ended up getting, a, 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 you know, a shot at. Imagine you just, you know, in your house, you're just, you know, just watching TV. Just Oh, mind you, this happened at 12 at night, so people are sleeping or getting ready for bed. Imagine all of a sudden you, you just hear a bunch of gunshots and... And, you know, and bullets going through your house. that would make you want to move. You know? So that's why these Edomites are, you know, pissed off about this. And eventually, you will, I know, I, and it's crazy because it's really the Lord setting this up. But that's fueling that, uh, that, that race, uh, that race war, man. You know? <laughs> right, the Lord is the uh, ultimate chess player. Every move is uh, important. Okay? You know, that's a whole nother lesson within itself. All right, but let me get one more scripture and we'll end it off with this. This is the book of uh, Zechariah, chapter 13, uh, verse, uh, what is it, uh, 8 and 9. And it reads here, And it shall come to pass that in all the land, saith the Lord Yahweh, two parts therein shall be cut off and die, but the third shall be left therein. All right, two thirds are going to be destroyed, all right? And the reason why is because, you know, of all the uh, 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 all the lack of knowledge, okay. Instead of them following the ways of Yahweh Bashmiel Shai, they're following the ways of Esau, which is the ways of death, okay. You know, so they're going to be destroyed for that. 
Let's keep reading. Verse 9. And I will bring the third part through the fire and will refine them as silver is refined and will try them as gold is tried. They shall call on my name and I will hear them. I will say it is my people and they shall say the Lord Yahweh is my power. And that's the one third. Those who are, you know, returning unto Yahweh Bashim al Shai, repenting, changing their ways, okay? You know, trying to grow, be a better person, okay? And who are continuing, you know, continuing um, separating themselves from this present evil world. All right. But um, that's pretty much it. You know, I'm going to uh, end this lesson. And I hope it was an edifying one to whomever, uh, you know, whomever was listening. And with that, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory unto you. How about you, Shai? Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And salutations to all you brothers out there. Shalom and a Bible ball.